Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing really well. Thank you so much for tuning in to this what should be quite fun vlog, something quite different for me. Um, so Tom and I are heading to Wilderness Festival tomorrow and we're going as guests of Audi. So it's been like really exciting to be invited and I haven't been to a festival in so long. Um, so I am planning on what to wear. From looking at photos of previous years, I think people go all out with their outfits and it's lots of um, like bold colors and sequins and tassels. And yeah, people should really go for it. Um, but I started to have a little look look around online and I came to the conclusion that I'm never gonna wear these pieces again that I was looking at buying and it just felt like such a waste of money and it also felt like really kind of not my style so I'm gonna do it in my own way and like go as bold as possible in my own way but wear things that I've already got because yeah as I said like I don't I hate buying clothes and then like not getting enough wear out of them so Okay, so the weather is going to be good tomorrow, so I'm happy to go kind of like summer vibes. So this is outfit number one option. I've got my Birkenstocks. I mean, I don't know what footwear to wear. Like, I'm just going to wear sandals. Black shorts, a little black crop top, and then this really funky shirt over the top. I quite like this one. I need two outfits. I need a daytime outfit um, and then we've got a dinner with the Audi team in the evening so then I would like to change outfits for the evening so I feel like daytime will be like more fun well both outfits are going to try and make fun but I feel like daytime obviously can be a bit more casual so I feel like something like this could be cool I really don't know anyway so this is the first outfit option I'm really enjoying the sunglass chain it's from Jimmy Fairley I need a little bag for the festival, like something that can just like go cross body so I'm hands free and that's like safe to put all of my bits in. I found this little one um, in my drawer, it's from Next, um, but the only thing is the strap is whoops, quite long so I'm actually just going to shorten this. So what I'll do is just put it to where I want it. I like my cross, so my like cross body bags, like let me take these off. I like them quite high, so maybe like, like there, is that too high? I feel like that positioning is good. So then what I do is make a dent with the, um, what's it called, like the belt, the whole thing. So about there. And then, guys, you need, if you don't have one of these, these are so handy for like belts and bags, um, really, really useful. So basically it punches in a new hole. So there's different sizes on here, so I'm just gonna kind of see what the other size is. I think that'll be fine. And then you have to be, you have to really squeeze it quite hard. That's it. Perfect, look, so good. Amazing, okay, so happy with that little bag. Okay, next potential look, and this could work really well for the evening. Or is it more daytime? I don't know yet. Um, yeah, I really like this. This is fairly new from H&M. Love these big sleeves. It's actually gonna be quite warm tomorrow, so I want something quite, like, breathable. And although this is long, I feel like it's quite loose and the fabric is, like, fairly breathable. So I feel like this could be, this could be a good day option. I just, I'm worried that I'm not going dressy enough. I'm worried that these looks are too casual. Okay, next up, we are all orange and I love it. I think I might wear this dress in the evening because it has got more of like a satin, um, it's more of like a satiny fabric, so I feel like it is more dressy. I think that I'm gonna do this for the evening. There's a company called Cocoon Club who loan out and rent out design handbags and I have rented a small little um, YSL bag so I'm just waiting for that to arrive today, but I think I'll wear that for the evening. I feel like that will really like dress it up and make it more of an evening look. Um, it's quite a low back, so I just need to make sure that my bra is pulled right down on that. But I love that. And also, guys, the most exciting thing that's happened this morning, and I haven't, I will show you later. I might give you a little sneak peek out the window. Um, but as I said at the start of the vlog, we are going to Wilderness with Audi, um, and they have lent us, like loaned us an Audi 
to drive to the festival. And it's not just any Audi, it's a bright orange Audi TTS. I've just taken it, like it literally just arrived this morning and I've um, just taken it around the block and it's so fast. Here's a little sneak peek of her. Eek! So in a way I kind of like, I know I'm not gonna have the car, but I like weirdly want to, I don't know, match the car. And um, so I feel like this will just like tie in with the orange Audi vibes. The only thing with this dress is, I know Jesus like didn't wear orange, but I do feel, because it's like really long, and I think because of the shape of it, and then with the sandals, I'm feeling, I'm feeling a bit Jesus-y, but I mean Jesus, as I said, wouldn't wear orange. <laughs> And I'm styling it up a bit differently to probably he would. Um, it's got quite big splits up the side. I'm going to do a little tan tonight. And I'm going to pop lots of like jewellery on. So yeah, I think this will work for the evening. Um, I've also got this set. Um, this is from Fourth and Reckless. Um, I do really like this. But I think from like the shorts and shirt perspective, like, I prefer the first set that I showed you. Well, not that it was the first set. I mean like the first outfit. Um, this is a really cool pattern though. Do love this. I just think that I prefer the first one. I've also got this dress from H&M. Pick this up in the sale. Um, and I do actually really like it. I actually love the cut of it. It's really nice. The only thing is, is I was quite set on my black accessories, the bag and those sandals. And I feel like, I just feel like black it's too harsh to wear with a dress like this. I would probably want to wear more white or lighter accessories. It's the end of the day now and I went through my wardrobe earlier and I found this. And I'm thinking like, is this more festival-y? It's um, really old from And Other Stories. It's so gorgeous actually. It's the shirt and little shorts with these tassels on. So I feel like this is more festival-y. Okay, I've like had a little play around and because these black sandals are what I'm wearing with that orange dress for the evening, I don't want to take too much stuff. So I was ideally hoping that I could make the same pair of shoes work day and night. So I'm actually thinking that I quite like it like this. I put that little bralette on that I had on earlier, um, undone the shirt. This is the little bag I was talking about from Cocoon Club. So it's a luxury handbag rental company. And yes, yeah, so fun. So I've got this little bag for the weekend to take with me. And I'm actually, I'm thinking I quite like this. wilderness festival um, this is the booty camping area there's like loads of different kind of accommodations in here there's the teepee tents um yeah like loads of other bits over here but we are staying in one of these little cabins <laughs> it's so cute so just checked in and we've got a double bed i mean this is like for camping this is unreal if i'm ever gonna do a festival this is how i want to do it so we've actually got a double bed we are here with audi so we've got little audi welcome bags this is actually so spacious got a little mirror to get ready a fan um and there's actually like for camping how amazing is this got an actual flushing toilet in here and sink and shower amazing so so much fun um there was a little coffee stand in the reception so Tom has just gone to go and grab us a coffee and then we are booked in for um they've got like a spa here with um like big hot tubs like wooden hot tubs a lake where you can go swimming so we're booked in for that at 12 o'clock it's 11 so I think we're probably just gonna have our coffee and then head on in in there haven't been into like the main um festival area yet so um we'll probably head off soon <music> I already know we're going to have fun today. So my role is just to warm you up, to get wilderness underway, to have a pump.
had a hot tub experience earlier and we had like a wander around then we went to see Sophia Lispector which was so good um, and then we were still kind of like wet from the hot tub I just put clothes over my swimming costume so we have come back to the cabin to get ready for the evening it's quarter past four I've had three drinks today and I'm actually a bit drunk like I don't know what it is like alcohol just goes to my head so quickly it's because I don't drink often anyway my evening for the outfit is my no the other way around my outfit for the evening you know I showed you my outfits yesterday I've gone with the orange dress for tonight um it's one of those things that when you get here um like it just doesn't matter what you're wearing because like I've seen so many people I've seen so like so many different dress like styles and like basically you can just wear what you want like it doesn't matter what you're wearing yeah I feel actually quite smart with what I'm wearing but I'm like this is really comfortable and I'm happy with it but a little secret I'm wearing nipple daisies for the first time because I'll show you my outfit in a minute properly when Tom's ready can't get to the back what are you doing you look like Kevin and Perry, go large. No, I think we need to lose that hat, Tom. Anyway, can we just... Hello, Mr. Person. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so I've just like layered out with lots of jewellery. Um, I've got my little bag that I showed you earlier. The only thing is, it's a bit annoying that like my phone doesn't fit in it. Um, but I don't know what I'm going to Like, I'll just hold my phone. And then I've just got on my, uh, my Jesus sandals because they're like super comfortable. Anyway, look around here. It's so cute. All the little cabins. Well, Tom honestly takes like twice as long as me to get ready because he just faps them out. So yeah, once he's ready, we will head back in. We have got a dinner with the Audi team tonight. I'm actually gonna leave my vlogging camera in the cabin because it's just like, I just don't wanna lose anything. And um, so I will record some snippets on my phone later. But before we head out, I'm gonna show you a full outfit. Ready? Same. Right. now I've just noticed how dirty my mirror looks in this light um, and it's Saturday today and it's my grandma's birthday so we are heading out for dinner um, and I'm wearing the zebra dress that I was gonna wear at wilderness and didn't end up wearing it um, it's from H&M I love it I just like love these big sleeves really nice and loose but it's got this split up the front got it on just with some Birkenstocks we're just going for like a fairly casual dinner and my basket bag I've put this um, perfume on, it's Bitter Mandarin by Jo Malone, and it's so nice. It's really like fresh and fruity, but not a sweet fruity. Um, it's just like really refreshing and feels so summery. Good morning, everyone. I hope you can see me because like, the sun's right behind. I am in Cambridge. I've never been here before. I'm so excited to be here. Um, it is five to 10 and I'm meeting my friend Hayley here because she lives near Norfolk and where I am in Hertfordshire, this is kind of like a middle, middle meeting point. So we've been trying to do this for ages and like each time something happens and we aren't able to do it and it's finally happening today. So yeah, I mean, Hayley, um, this morning I've just, found a car park and I'm just walking through this field and it says on my map this is Parker's Parker's piece if you are local around here you'll know where I am um, but we are meeting at the University Arms Hotel um, I haven't obviously been here but I've seen it online it looks so nice so I think we're gonna just sit and have a coffee and a little catch up before we like have a bit of a mooch around such a gorgeous day today and it's also my dad's birthday so um later i am going around there for a barbecue which would be so nice and um, i'll show you my outfit in more detail when we sit but i've got um a little play suit on from pretty lavish um 
and then I did bring a second outfit because we are hopefully gonna just like I'd like to get a little reel of this outfit and another outfit as well anyway nearly there so I'll show you when I get there to just finish making the pavlova to take to the barbecue this evening and then I've got a call before I go so I just need to quickly get all of this done have my call and then I think I'm just gonna like take off all my makeup um to go out later because you know when it's just so hot I just hate wearing makeup so I think I'm gonna like take off all my jewelry makeup off hair up and like feel a lot cooler I can't remember if I said or not but basically I made the um pavlova base like the meringue last night I basically just kept it in the oven um here um so I've just whipped up my cream and then I've just chopped some berries and now I'm going to assemble just got to the train station and I've bought my smoothie with me I didn't think this through what am I gonna do with that I've got a little bag in here I can put it in so it's Friday today another lovely warm sunny hot day I've been wearing like linen all week um, and today I just didn't have like oh, I was gonna say I didn't have time but basically but I couldn't be bothered to steam so I've got very creased shirts and very creased linen shorts on I was in London yesterday as you saw um, I met my friend Jess and then Georgia I've been having so many like back-to-back -back work from home days um, and then I've had so many like then three days out in a row so it's just like all of my days out have like come in a row um, but I don't mind it's actually like although I'm such a home girl and love being at home having too many days at home all day on my own does get too much like Tom leaves for work at about like half past seven and he usually goes to the gym straight from work and probably doesn't get home till half past six so I spend that like entire day on my own which I normally don't mind but having so many of those days back to back like in a row it is nice to get out and change it up so I'm happy to be out and about today by the way it's it's 10 to 9 let me just make sure okay my train goes in nine minutes so I'll make this quick um uh first port of call today is to the big primark on top no ugh, tottenham court road i'm working on them on an upcoming campaign and it's all about their primark cares range which is um sustainably made and kind of like the whole process of it is sustainable and i find that actually a lot of like when you want to buy sustainable clothing it's really expensive and i know it's it's not possible for everyone but i know everybody wants to kind of do their bit and kind of help in this crisis that we're living in so i think it's great because primark have done this and they've done it in an extremely good price point so it is accessible for everyone so i'm really excited to see what they've got so i'm going to be picking up some bits then i am going to see dr selena um for a botox top up it's such a sunny morning i'm on the platform now and it's so weird because normally if i get this train the platform is packed and there's like me and three other people people obviously just don't travel into London on Friday I've got sun cream on and you know when your eyes water and the sun cream goes in your eyes oh, I'm also makeup free today because I just felt like I just wanted my skin to breathe um, also that smoothie that I just had had chia seeds in and now they're all stuck in my bloody teeth so I'm going to have to <laughs> 
buy a box of water when I get there and have a little, a little mouth gurgle. Anyway, here's my train. Hi everyone, it's now Saturday. Um, I was in London yesterday, but it ended up being so rushy and like busy and I just didn't end up getting the vlogging camera out. But I went to Primark, got lots of bits to style up from their new um, like sustainable ranges, uh, like Primark Cares. Then I went and had my um, Botox topped up. The first time I ever had it done, they do say it takes like 10 days to kick in. Um, and it did for like on the first time but then since then it's like kicked in after like one to two days it's been like super quick so I've been shooting some campaigns this morning at home and now I am going out for some lunch in the sun um so I'm literally just about heading out and I wanted to show you two products I'm loving in the sunshine first of all is this it's from rituals which I just love everything they do it just smells unbelievable and this is the hair and body mist in the scent holy lotus and organic white tea it's such a cute little bottle i mean i know it's not going to last me for ages but it's really like easy to pop in your handbag and it is the freshest smell ever it i can't describe it it just it just smells so nice and so fresh and i've had loads of compliments um, when I've seen people, they're like, oh my gosh, you smell so nice. I'm like, it's this, it's so nice. So I am probably going to buy the um, the full size in that because I love it. Um, oh, I'm such an awkward angle here. <laughs> and then this lip balm from Fresh Beauty. It's in their sugar range and it's in the shade Honey. I've completely like, oh my God, I thought it was stuck. It's like gone a bit funny where it's melted a bit. Um, but this is the shade. And it really is it's the nicest, like, like it almost doesn't look like anything on your lips, but it just makes your lips feel really hydrated, soft, and like gives them just a nice little tint. You know, outfit of the day. Oh, I'm crouching down here. Can't, can't really show you here, but I've just got a pink linen shirt on. This is from New Look. Um, it's so hot today. It's Saturday. It's like, it's another heat wave here in the UK. Um, but for me, I actually feel cooler wearing like a like a linen shirt rather than like a little strappy top on holiday i love it you know it's just so different when you're in the uk i just don't like being hot and i don't like getting sunburned so i just like keep covered up on the top and then on my bottoms i've got some um white linen shorts good morning everyone it's now monday morning um it's about 8 a.m and i'm just about to leave to head into london i'm going to end this vlog here because while i'm in london today i've got a breakfast meeting and then a lunch event um so in between those i'm hoping to get this vlog edited um so i'm gonna leave you here i've just started a new weekly vlog so that will be live next week um, thank you so so much for watching. I always say like I really appreciate you spending your time to watch my vlog So thank you so much. I hope you guys have a wonderful week and I'll see you next week. Bye